Me Love Bingo started in my living room because a dear friend gave me a bingo cage for my birthday, like you do. Um, and so I started hosting these bingo nights in my living room and I would buy some silly prizes, have uh, seven or so friends come sit on my living room floor and then we'd play bingo. Someone coming to this experience is in for a night of games and fun. We are actually playing bingo. And then on top of that, we have these variety hour type performance numbers. Um, there's this element of a sort of Pee Wee's Playhouse vibe. So we have these puppet pals and sidekick characters that appear throughout the show. There's a lot of lovely visual storytelling. There's fun music that we're playing. So it's a real festive environment in that way. Bingo feels like this perfect metaphor for life in these ideas of chance and luck. And there's something uh, so familiar that connects to so many other parts of life about the holidays, about these big world celebrations and life events that uh, finds so many, for me, beautiful connections within the bingo cage and the act of playing bingo. You know, there's so many layers of blood family, thinking back on the past, um, traditions, that these concepts can be really hard for a lot of people in the queer and trans community, as well as lots of other people in the world, right? It can be, feel like a very challenging, sometimes lonely time of year, sometimes depressing. Um, and so it is so important to me and to all of us working on Me Love Bingo that we're making this really inclusive space where truly everyone has a seat at the table, at the bingo table, right? At the holiday table. However you celebrate the holidays, if you don't, if you're trying to just get through them, however you move through this time of year, that you are welcome here and that you belong here at Me Love Bingo. And that's really important to me. So we're really making this um, joyful space that we really are centering queer joy as opposed to queer trauma, which often becomes so much of the uh, the narrative that uh, people are interested in. You know, it's not about our coming out stories or anything. It's about how we, as these different queer people, move through life on this earth and find joy and connection. And through sharing our personal stories, we hope that that serves as an invitation for connection for everyone, right? For everyone to find, um, find a space for them within this environment and this story.